So we shall continue with our drawing by placing all the windows. So I will take the reference length from here. Let's enter. I will also take the reference length from here. So let's assume we have 600. Let's enter. So we also need to introduce a window here. So I will repeat the same. And let's take so let's take somewhere around here to the 1200 millimeters. Press enter. Then draw. Now the essence of this is to introduce we're going to have windows of dimension 1.2 meters. And so all you just need to do is introduce offset and then let's have 1.2 meters click and drag the same applies to this click and drag so so Drag. and then for this let's introduce okay, we can still so let's introduce a lesser world um, window of let's say uh, 700 and then click and drag click and drag and so we all have all the windows however there's a way we can modify the windows to make it look neater and so So as uh, modifications were made on this drawing plan, as you can see, the orientation of the door has been changed and we moved towards the left hand side. The essence of this was to ensure that the window opens conveniently so that there will be ventilation. And also the walls around some of the vicinities here were cleaned up except this one which we, we shall still look at because we want this porch to be something similar to this which means that there's an opening here we may likely have a column here and a column here in the course of the drawing and also i would like to mention that the modifications were made for the bedroom windows so this bedroom window had been increased the length as well as this and the uh, window of the uh, living room. This is to ensure that there is proper ventilation in the building. So we are going to create windows and one way of doing that is by drawing a rectangle. We can use the rectangle command, this, but for now let's use the polyline and let's draw, let's start with the living room. It has a dimension of 1800 and then a width of 225. Then let's also take it back 1800 and then we close it. So let's draw another one. Sorry, let's repeat this. So 
the essence of doing this is to let's modify remember that our layers we've created layers for windows so we need to adopt it and and there the color have changed so let's continue let's have let's take this as 100 let's then also take from this portion take 100 press enter and then we shall introduce a line across so let's click on the command <clears throat> and for my end points i can have my midpoint here and then I shall also have that my press enter and so we have the window for the living room and so we can introduce this so we are going to move this window and place it here and so one way of doing that is by clicking the copy command and then we click and highlight everything press enter and then let's pick a base point let's pick this portion here and then move now notice that it is moving on a straight line and that's because the auto mode has been activated so let's restrict it and close so that you can see that it has moved freely so we are going to place it here let's use this portion as our second base point and then press enter and there we have our window so our window has been placed now we are going to introduce windows for all the portions here so let's quickly create windows for the uh, for the Okay, let's click on this to make it straight so let's create windows for the bedrooms so we have 1500 press enter we have 1500 so let's create So we shall also create for all the other uh, windows for the vertical portions in our next uh, video. So don't forget to click and like this video and subscribe to my channel.